make sure that we're live here. Twitch has been one of those, well, it's been silly recently and sometimes not really properly showing that things are working. So <clears throat> anyhow, there we go. So that's for good. So anyway, um, hi, welcome back to Subnautica Below Zero, which I haven't played in at least a month and a half, maybe two, something like that. Uh, you can tell from here that there was a an update which is exciting so i'm back they added a whole bunch of stuff to it oh turn up the music a little bit too they added a whole bunch of stuff to it uh mainly around the story which is both good and bad for us there we go that should give you audio now um so they they say that it's backwards compatible with the I'm looking oh accessibility right yes um, they say it's backwards compatible with your current everything's right um, but as you can see here the below zero story is now fully voiced and they recommend starting a new game so um, as much as I want to play you know the game that I have I'm gonna not do that because I feel like we should see see more of the story. Um, it sucks to lose the progress that I do have, but <clears throat> you know it, it's all good. Now that said, we played in survival last time, um, but I kind of don't want to deal with hunger or thirst since we're just kind of checking things out for the story. So I want to put on freedom mode for this for this run. I'm kind of fully expecting to eventually have to restart my game anyway, whenever the next update comes out or whenever they finish the game. <laughs> so we'll we'll play on proper survival mode at that point in time. But for now, I, I just want to see the new stuff, enjoy story hopefully enjoy it and without food that'll be easier it's a lovely day today by the way in my part of the world this is the furthest that i can take you on company space bucks robin you're sure you want this the research is in everything it is to me and Sam. I need to know what happened. Well, this, your store. Is this a new voice? I can use it for cover from Altera's eyes. <sighs> Gonna miss you, Robin. I'll find my way back. Approaching 45, 46 feet. Surface temperature. Life pod deployed. The computer said life pod, subtitle said drop pod. They should probably fix that. Drop pod. Welcome to cool, actually. Enjoy your stay. <laughs> oh, that's good. That is good. Made it to four five four six B. Landing was a bit rough, but I don't think I'll tear a spot. I hid from the satellite. The drop pod deployed with Gus. Just have to find it and get settled. Then I'll be in the kitchen. Easy enough. I wonder if meteor storms are going to be a common weather effect at all. Or if it's only during the beginning of the game. 
We oh she actually did she die before? I don't remember. It's a nice touch if she didn't. Hi. Hey. New Thanks. creature discovered. It sounds like they computerized New the creature discovered. computer voice a little bit. So it still sounds like it's customer support from India, but with a with a heavier emphasis on the computer part there. So not bad. Because um, I know that was a complaint when they introduced it before, was that it really it sounded too much like a human and not enough like a, uh, a computer. Alright. Hello, base. Found the drop pod. Log is communication, so I write this. All right, let's check this stuff out. Whoa, whoa, jeez. Sorry, I opened the, the Steam Relay. Um, I think none of this has changed, right? Lillian Bench. Notice of death. I don't think that changed either. Uh, I remember this. These were voiced before, right? But now the voice has Robin, changed. Guess what? I got the job. I'm going to 4546B. Now I'll be able to improve the mechanical avian amphibian under real-world stress conditions. Listen, I know your stance on Altera, but I just hope you're happy your sis is happy. I sure hope my sis... I don't think that one changed, though. Where's, um... Okay. First on log. Found the drop pod. Is there anything better than being not cold and not wet? Well, I guess being not on fire and not injured aren't bad either. Now that I'm settled, I can start to look for you, Sam. I should reread the message your colleague sent me. Was this supposed to play when I got into the drop pod? Maybe it did and I just missed well, it. Sam, <laughs> I well, Sam, I was a little bit too, too fast. Starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Okay, cool. So they're giving you better direction. I remember that was one of my complaints before. Right, there's the thing about the PDA. Just want to clear these things out. Players, I'm sure you, okay. Cool. There's the voice lock. Wait for those to go away. Okay, we're starting off with scanner and knife, which is good, and an O tank, which I'll probably want to make first. Cool. I don't know why I grabbed the fish. I guess old habits. Interesting. So when you play on uh, freedom mode, it doesn't even bother giving you. Um, doesn't bother giving you those at all. Um, like the recipes for stuff. Ooh, it is nice out, isn't it? Okay, so without further ado, should be able to use this. I'm gonna get two pieces of titanium and see if I remember my way around this world. This way should be creep vine. And also, we're gonna go near a bunch of uh, frozen lads, so we'll we'll avoid them. I don't think I read any. Actually, wait. I think I need a knife first. But do I need rubber? So I need a seed cluster. Okay. So I'll probably need a little bit more titanium. I see the cluster though and a piece of something that I want. We'll need to make a scanner. Thank you. New blueprint synthesized. Ooh, I like the way it says synthesized. Oxygen. All Terra supply cash nearby. Yeah, okay. Copper is good. We need that for batteries. How much do we need for a battery? Just one. We need two ribbon plants though. Okay. 
I'm, um, I'm pretty happy to return to this world though, honestly. I really do enjoy Subnautica. Grab lead. Okay, there's... Oxygen. Uh, do I need quartz for anything? Yet. Wiring kit. It's silver. Okay, not yet. So ribbon... Ah, there we go. I knew there was some around the drop pod. I think... Yeah. I think my drop pod's in the same place it was last ribbon time. plants contain electrolytic materials that can be used in energy storage. Indeed they do, computer. I was a little nervous about dropping into an unknown area, but luckily this biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I can use for tools and upgrades. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos 5. When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. Hmm. Good character development, though. Or not development, but establishment, I guess. Like, kind of telling us why she has the PDA that is the way it is. Okay. Make a battery. And then make rubber. Cool. Thank you. All right, much. I have a scanner. I don't think I need any lubricant yet, right? Oh. You know, you gonna say that? No. Okay. Here, I'll play it then. In goes a battery in titanium. Now comes a scanner. Every xenobiologist's favorite tool. This planet has some fascinating flora and fauna, and I can't wait to learn about them. This will also give me access to a greater tool set. I'm assuming Altera left behind tech that I can scan for blueprints. That should make surviving and exploring out here a bit easier. Don't worry, Sam. I haven't forgotten I'm here for you. But it can't hurt to do a little research on the side, right? I know you would have done the same. I will find out what happened to you. I promise. Cool. Okay, so that gets me fins. Copper wire and wiring kit. So I need silver for my compass. Um, but mostly we just finally go. Oh, go ahead. some speed. Okay, she automatically equips them. Very good. Yoroshi Shonen. <clears throat> okay, hold on. Can we get? Do we have logs yet? Come here. Oi! 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 Come here. Let me, let me scan you, peeps. Be a good boy. Don't like the auto generate names, suggest ice clops. <laughs> it's good. <clears throat> also, for, um, for people viewing this Oxygen. dream who have come by before. Uh, you might notice that I'm currently using keyboard controls, which I normally don't do. The main reason is I am lazy um, and don't feel like dealing with the hassle of um, the weird button mappings that have that seem to be prevalent with Subnautica games. There's more copper. That's good. Still want silver. Okay, there. That gives me enough copper to make some good stuff. But first off, oh, I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? Oxygen. Slightly the wrong way. Not, not totally. Okay. So I'll get stuff to make uh, a tank. And then... New blueprint synthesized. There we go. There's the titanium I need. And we'll get her, her research logs while we're at it. Um, what are the... What are the controls... 
for oxygen. Oh shit, I might be too far down. No, we're good. Galena, lead, okay, um. Thank you. Um, let's see here. So I need the fiber mesh, which we have enough for. I have enough to make a copper wire for that. And then I'll make a fiber mesh. After that, um, oh, what the fuck is that shadow? That shadow is scarier than uh, anything else so far. Um, speaking of scary things, they mentioned that they have added void chilies. So I think I think the last thing that I ever did in my other game was fly off into the void to find out what creature lurks there. And it was just a regular chillis, right, I believe, from what I remember. So happy to see. Happy to see them, you know, put something out there. There we go. We're gonna need those. Blueprint synthesized. The standard oxygen tank can be upgraded for deluxe and VIP breathing. VIP breathing. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, but not yet. Um, cool. Let's save because I haven't done that yet. Okay. So um, now I'm gonna throw. Just put those in there. I don't think we need the creep find sample anymore for now. Yeah, we're probably we're probably good on that because I don't need any mesh yet until we get new suit stuff. So I'm just gonna toss it. I'm gonna try not to be a hoarder. <laughs> but I do want to get. Uh, Ooh, very nice. I do want to get the habitat builder. So I do vaguely remember where it is. I don't th think that I have enough oxygen to get there by myself. So our options are to create another tank. to create another tank to go down, which worked out pretty well last time. Um, or just use pipes like I did originally. And either of those will probably work. So. But I guess we could start off by going to the emergency supply cache. Because there's probably, we'll get more story that way. So let me not blue ball you on the story. Hello, oh, light. Is that just creep vine poking through the surface? Yeah, it is. Twisted Pandrake. Dark coral zones. Huh. Kind of a weird place for it then, isn't it? Um, I'll need quartz eventually, so I'll grab it a little bit now. Shelf coral. Oh, hi. You'll very likely need some of that at some point, but. Thank you. Uh, we will need another battery, I'm sure. So we'll grab that. Uh, I'm underneath something that will prevent me from any oxygen. Those fuckers, let's not be near you. I remember they killed me the first time. <laughs> or my first death when I first played this was to one of those just freezing me out of nowhere. Who fish? Let's get that scan in. Or whole fish, sorry. Hello, friend. No, 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 no. 
kindly fuck off. I know what you do. Little fucking sea urchin. Nope! Stop trying to steal my shit. Very good. Okay. Um, oxygen. Okay, let's go back to the cache. if our thing is still going to be stolen from us. Okay, there's a log. Mineral detector. Kind of a whatever item, in my opinion. But... New blueprint synthesized. Flare. Always helpful. Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay, so it's it's space to uh, to ascend. I don't know what descending is. The hell? Actually, I should look that up because I'm I'm not used to the controls here. Move down to C. Oh, like crouch. Okay. Cool. Da -da -da. I think that's not new. Investigate with caution. Sure. Meh. The beacons will be more useful. Oh, that's another feature that they added. If you carry around a beacon with you, when you die, it drops so you can find your stuff easier, which is pretty nice. I'm telling you, Sammy, you see some weird oh, things. Wow, nice you chin, have Fred. Your day in a sea truck. More vandalism? Was it the sea monkeys again? I don't think so. Well, I can't shake the feeling this planet is cursed. <laughs> There's no such thing as a curse. Yeah, you're probably right. That's nothing. You wouldn't want to hear about it anyway. Just a huge creature frozen in ice. What? Where? In a cave, not far from your lab. And here's the extra weird part. As soon as I called it in, they closed off the area. Don't want anyone going in there. But why? Sammy, I'm no biologist, but I think there was something wrong with it. Its skin just seemed off, alien. An alien on planet 4546B. No. I'm serious, Sam. <laughs> Something ain't right. Wish I could show you, but I can't get back in there. You can't. But I might know how to. Sam, that's thinking, a bad idea. We never had this conversation. Cool. Well, I like that we get to see what the characters look like now. As opposed to just reading them from before. Let's see if I can find... A little bit of titanium is always good. Um, mainly want silver though. Because silver will get us a compass. That's good. I'm not too worried about oxygen right now, by the way, because um, there's a plant right next to us that will give us some. So that would be nice. More copper. And I just used it by accident. So hopefully there's another. Oh, I think this this is silver, right? No, it's it's gold. Uh, there should be another oxygen plant down here, though. Kelp root. Thank you. Oxygen, oxygen. There it is. Cool. Um. There's the spinning lads. There's sea monkey. All right, give me that oxygen. Nope, nope, you get nothing. Good day. Good day, sea monkey, good day. No stealing my shit. Damn, I want titanium. 
I do like this bit of exploration though. Like the oxygen plants, I think are, are a welcome addition to Subnautica in general, just because, you know, you, you can have these locations where you kind of dive in and look around for stuff and you don't worry as much about, oh, about um, oxygen. So it's a plus for sure. Okay, cool. Uh -huh. Hold on, we'll go down there in a second. No silver still, but it's okay. Um, I know where we can where we can get the habitat builder. Though I can't remember if the habitat builder needs. It probably needs a wiring kit. In which case, we still need silver. More food we don't need. Oops. Okay. Might as well get a scan of these before we go back up. Da da da. Tender should be trimmed to effectively harvest the edible heart. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Okay. I wonder, hmm, should I let a sea monkey steal like my scanner or something? We could let it happen just for the audio. But I think the monster frozen in ice journal log is probably like all they really intended for you to get in just in case. There we go, more titanium. Cool. Is that new? This little guy? Creature egg. I wonder if uh, it's actually... That looks like it might connect to the cave down there. Down you go. Alright, is this... Nothing terribly exciting, but this is good though. What have we here? Oh, it's a sea monkey egg. Uh, I'm good. Laser cutter fragment though. Thank you. Any anything else down here? Not really. So we'll just go up. Gold? Yeah, gold. Okay. Cool. Let's head back towards the base. I think I'll go down to the um, the twisty area next. Let's hold on. Tell you what. Let me grab a couple bits of creep vine, and we'll make ourselves a second tank so we can dive better. Ooh, oh god, my foot's asleep. Nope, be gone with you, creature of the abyss. Thanks, a mesh. And we'll get our second battery. And of course, another copper wire. Okay, that's good. Like I said, it is tempting to do um, the air pump trick again, because that really does work well for going deep quickly. Oh, if I make rubber, I can make it. Hmm. You know, that might be, they might have improved it. Maybe. <laughs> okay, let me make my second tank. I just need rubber for it. All right, let's go get some rubber. Um, I dropped, let's see if it's still around here. Nah, I don't see it, all right. We'll just head bullseye shroom. 
to do. All right, still, still not done yet. I mean, the update didn't say that they finished any more logs, so I'm not really thinking it's that. It seemed like everything was mostly focused around audio, and that was their their big update. Which, you know, to be fair, is um, is a pretty good update for pandemic times. All things considered. Because I know... 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, 30 seconds of... Oh, I didn't fill it. Oh, you're fine. That's a good reminder at the very least. There we go. We have two whole tanks of oxygen. So we'll be able to dive down pretty deep and hopefully find that habitat finder that I vaguely remember where it is. Basically we're gonna go to where I built my base in my other run, the pre-update run. Oh, there it was. It's floating right there. I I was looking down. <laughs> Alright, thank you. Apparently those are, um, you know, they float now. It's good. And thank you. The mineral detector can sniff out raw materials, potentially saving you hundreds of hours of searching. Hmm. I shouldn't have done that. I should have made, um, Actually, oh no, it's fine. Yeah, it's fine. Okay. So I want, I want a little more titanium. How much? Um, okay, we need at least one piece of raw quartz for a hatch eventually. I don't need gold at the moment. Uh, we don't need water at all, so that's kind of a whatever. Need might be nice. I mean, I'll keep it for now just because, but. Okay, let's get a little bit of titanium. Copper ore, okay. There. Uh, what we need, is that enough? Pipe just needs two, but we want many pipes, so because we're gonna go, we're gonna go pretty deep to get down to that area. Also, let's see here, quartz, nah. Fragment, gold, silver ore. Um, does anyone remember what type of mineral silver comes from? Not Calvarite, not Galena. Calvarite, Galena. Limestone, maybe? That's copper. Argentine's lead, right? Oh no, it's not. That's Cal. Alright, maybe it's this one then. Okay. Oh, there we go. That's enough for two sets of pipes. So, call that good. Oxygen. Also, wait a minute. Did they finally solve the problem of the lag whenever you sub, whenever you surface, or is it just because we haven't explored a lot yet? Or maybe it's because the weather is bad. Da, da, da. Oh, I want to make a beacon. That's what I was thinking of. But we don't have the... Oh, wait, it's deployable. Use beacons to mark traverse territory. Now with surface support. Use your Xenoworks PDA to show or hide the signals of your choice. Sure. What we'll do? I, I actually want one more piece of titanium, sorry. Bad memory again. 
I needed one more. But once we have that, then we'll have a beacon for if we get eaten, as well as uh, yes, as well as anything else. And then we can dive down with our pipes. Pipes and oxygen makes for a good exploratory tool. So I'm going to go to where my old base used to be and set up my pipes there, I think. Or, well, hmm. actually the pipes aren't totally close to it, but it's fine. Okay, it's fine. And then we'll need lubricant at some point, but... I just want to clear those out of my inventory a little. Okay. Oh yeah, pipes galore. Okay, so if I remember correctly, from our cute little base here, there's some Altera stuff over that way. That's a good thing too. Um, the main area is over that way, which means my base, or rather where my old base was pre-update, is over this direction, I think. We'll see if I'm right. Also, I'll keep my, uh, my search on, just in case we run by anything that I think might be silver. But I also kind of imagine this is going to absolutely murder our battery. Hi, sea monkey. There we go. Look at this. Look at this nice place. There's the little loop. Oh, I see, uh, hold on. Let's go get auction and then dive down to get that part. What the fuck? Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> oh, is that the, is that the alien signal? Holy shit. Well, they updated it. It's now scarier. Dun 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 New blueprint synthesized. Transmission of unknown origin. Source of transmission depth calculated at approximately 200 meters. Yes, indeed. Ooh, hey, look, shiny. That's probably about 100 meters down. All right, here, let's, let's dive here. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. That sounds like a distress call. Does it? Does it, Sam? All right, here we go. Totally tubular. It's gonna take me a little bit to get used to the um, the controls here. Oh, hi lag. How's it going? Almost there. Oop, a little bit, a little bit higher. Uh, there. Thanks for the oxygen. Let's um, let's stop it there for now. Warning. Well, parsing 100 meters, oxygen efficiency decreased. Two PDS. Disciplinary meeting and sea truck log. There's more pieces over there that I'll grab in a second as well. Oh, sweet. Blink. 100 meters. Just uh, get on there. I'm using the the option for 
pausing when you open your thing just so we can enjoy the voice calls and everything else but ooh, what's this I'm meeting personal favors fred great to see you come on in you don't mind if i record this do you uh am i in trouble <laughs> no you know me just a fanatic for details and my memory's not what it used to be <laughs> i know what that's like <laughs> yes is that why you've been running so many personal errands for your colleagues? We asked you to limit them. Uh, so I am in trouble. That's not how I want you to look at it. Here's what I see. Yes. You're a team player. You want to get the job done. Well, I think I have a pretty good record there. You want people to like you. Has anyone complained? Fred, the trouble is, not everyone is as reliable as you are. Sometimes people need help being where they need to be and concentrating on their work. You All the trips were work quiet. related. It appears you transported Warning. tech for Lil rather far out from her base. Well, we needed to go deep and she needed a sea truck. Her work is currently on surface installations. She shouldn't be anywhere near the water. I, uh, well, I. No more favors to friends, agreed? Yes, sir. <laughs> ah, I keep telling you. Call me Manu. <laughs> that was indeed uncomfortable laughter. <laughs> also, is Manu something that people named Emmanuel go by? I would have expected like Manny or something like that. All right. I'm telling you, Sammy, you see some weird things when you spend half your day in a sea truck. More vandalism? Was it the sea monkeys again? I can't shake the feeling. This planet is cursed. Oh wait, we've listened to this already. There's no such thing as a curse. Yeah, probably That's You wouldn't want to hear about it anyway. Just a huge creature frozen in ice. What? Where? In a cave, not far from your lab. And here's the extra weird Go 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 I think there was something wrong with it. Its skin just seemed off. Alien. An alien on planet 4546B. No. I'm serious, Sam. Something ain't right. Wish I could show you, but I can't get back in there. You can't. But I might know how to. Whatever you're thinking, we never had this conversation. Okay. So we just got a lot of stuff. Uh, Awesome. I can make this now. So we'll make that soon. But first, Habitat Builder. Remember how long it took me last time to get this? Like three streams at least. All right, wiring kit, computer chip. So I have the glass. We'll need the more titanium. Um, that's fine. The computer chip. Where's the electronics? There it is. So I have gold. We'll need to get the table coral. And the other bits for silver. So. Hey. No, 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 no. No, I, I want this here. Thank you. Cool. Warning. Parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Yeah, well, you know, you can't have everything. I think, um, so I believe there are sharks near this area, but not directly right here, which is good. Warning, 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. But what I'd like to do is try to collect some more silver as much as possible anyway. More silver and titanium. One but also, thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. We also got the um, the blueprints for. Where's my pipe? Pipe, 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 pipe. pipe. Um, also got the sea truck. So that's also something that we got a lot faster than last time. So that's good. But of course, we'll need to get the mobile vehicle bay before we can actually make that. We'll be able to make the sea glide as soon as we get back home, though, which is good. 
So we'll make the sea glide, we'll make the building tool, which is going to require. <sighs> it's going to require more silver, unsurprisingly. Yeah, we want Argentine. So you'd think that this little, uh, there we go. I think we need two pieces of table core, right? And then we'll probably need one for a fabricator at some point. So I'll grab more now. Oh, sweet. <sighs> wow. New blueprint synthesized. This is going much faster than previously expected. I mean, it could be because, you know, I've, I've played through most of it by now, but even still for Subnautica is going fast. I had the pleasure of replaying the original Subnautica recently. Oh, there's a thing over there. Not all the way through, but um, one of my my brother's girlfriend really likes. Oh, you don't you don't get the locker from this anymore, or did I already get it? Um, but she really likes Subnautica and like watching people play it. So. Warning: thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. I played it for a little bit last time I hung out with them. You. Let's go towards Warning. the um parsing one hundred meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Where's that shiny bit? Oh wait, we can get more uh, titanium from scanning the fragments. Hi Ray. Metal Gear Ray. Right. Um, more there. Alright, that this should give us more than enough titanium, I think, for now. No, it's really just a matter of getting Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. the things we need. Okay, well, according to this, there's uh, silver directly next to me. Yes, that's two, so that's one wiring kit. Hello. Oh, well, I don't really need to get that. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Um, I have another tank, so I'm not that worried. Where is it? Oh, right there. Damn it. Oxygen. Noted. What? Which direction? Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Oh, that's um, the angry lad. Hold up. This will be a better op option to do. Oxygen. I. We should be able to make it to the surface. Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, yeah, I know. Um, I think it'll probably be best to make. can't actually see where my uh, pipe is at the moment, which is why we kind of lost it down there. But my pipe is around here somewhere. And that's the uh, that's the Altera wreck over there. So this isn't a bad place to put a beacon. It's just a matter of figuring out where my pipe went. Oh, also I should refill my tank. So it's in a hole. We should be able to find it. I, I couldn't have gone that far. Oh, there are the sharks. Um, anyone see a silver tube extending from the surface down?
It's amazing how hard it is to find things sometimes. Hey, this is where my uh, this is where my base is. This little hole over here, and probably where I will set my base again. Warning. Because it really was a good location. Oh, looks like the sun's coming out. <laughs> it's good. I put my beacon pretty much right where I need it to be. Boing! Is that it? Is that tiny nub over there it? Probably not. I'll find it again eventually, don't worry. But for now, let's go make a sea glide. We'll make a sea glide and perhaps another beacon. Is it fiber mesh that beacons need? Beacon, beacon, beacon. Copper. On our way back, I'll try to try to keep an ear out. Hi, sharks, friends. I mean, like, not really, <laughs> but, you know. I kind of wonder... 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I kind of wonder if they modified the amount of time it takes for uh, batteries to, to go away or not. Sad. A bit of corpse. Do, 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 Thirty seconds do, 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 of oxygen do. remaining. Yeah, it's fine. Wow, that's a weird looking one. Scaly maw anemone. Prefer shallow water and ample exposure to sunlight. Hmm. Nice, nice world building lore. Okay, so let's make another beacon to carry around with us in the untimely event of our death. And then, let's see here. I do want to make that but it takes a piece of our silver and I need to make the builder tool first. We just need to wire and can computer chip. Or actually, sorry, I don't want to make that yet. I want to make the sea glide. Lubricant, battery, copper wire. Ah, oh, we got, oh God. Let me grab our lubricant, copper wire and glass. What else do I need? Anything else? I'll grab the gold while we have it. I mean, I could just bring everything, but okay. So a battery, which needs ribbon plants, which are directly below our pod. So Ah, but they haven't respawned yet. All right, hold on. We got this. We could use the um, the halfway done one from our mineral collector, but we'll see. I have a feeling that I'm gonna find them more so in the shallows, maybe down this way? I feel like we often find them in like little caves. So. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's hailing again. I wonder how often it hails in the actual Arctic. Hi, hope fish. They are edible.
when they're apparently curious. Oxygen. Mm-hmm. No, it could do. Can this only find... Ah. Uh, Drat. Right. It's too bad. I was hoping maybe it could help us find a ribbon plant or two. Oh, those are the frozen dudes. That's not. Ribbon plant. Ribbon plant. They glow green. We should be able to spot them pretty easily once we find one. Do they ever grow near creep pines? Or does the creep pine kind of act like a weed? I'll hear the we're closer. Oh, there we go. Here we go. Two beautiful creep vines ready to become exactly what we need. I just want to keep this thing on uh, Argentine for silver because silver seems to be the thing we have the hardest time finding. So. All right, we definitely have enough iron to make an ingot though. So we can get one step closer. Hello, let's get enough for another battery, shall we? Oxygen. Oxygen. Okay, so battery first. And next, Sea Glide. The Sea Glide is a personal transportation device used for high speed free diving, contains a built in light and map. And then we need copper wire. Wow, I really... Hmm. Strange. I thought I had enough copper. But okay. Loop kind of computer chip. Computer chips need copper wire. Not that much else. Might be able to get. <laughs> we might be able to get the uh, mobile vehicle bay a little faster than I was expecting. Not bad. Okay, cool. Um, let's let's do this real quick. Remove that. Uh, we'll grab. Put that up there. Habitat builders will stay pinned for now. We need more silver. Compass first. I think. As rare as silver is. Oh, wait, well, compass first or builder tool first? Builder tool, I guess. Wait, so wait, hold on. Let me grab uh, the creep vine out here. The, the seed, I mean, because we need to make a little bit of lubricant. There we go. So that and that can go in there, some of the wiring kit. Um, I guess I don't really need the gold yet. Or the glass, we don't need to carry that around yet. 
and four of you. One, two, three, four. Go in there. Copper. It's mainly copper. All right. I'm surprised. I, I mean, I guess the early game stuff all really wants a lot more copper than one generally expects. So, all good. Should be easy to get compared to silver. Limestone. Oops. The annoying thing is that playing with the controller, there was a way to go um, to go back and forth, so you could kind of cycle backwards as well. But also, I wonder if they fixed the scanner map. <laughs> I really hope they did. I certainly left enough like <laughs> enough complaints to them. How much copper do we need anyway? Maybe like oxygen. At least six pieces. Hey, where? Is it above me? Yes. Oxygen. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Hi, penguins. I mean, you can never have too much titanium, I suppose, really. And eventually we'll make a, um, the decomposer, whatever it's called, the, the Recyclotron, was that its name? We'll make that eventually, so. Okay, so we need a battery. We need copper. So now we have, we have everything we need for the builder tool. Oops, back please. So give me my gold, this stuff, that stuff, this, that, and the other thing. Computer chip first. Yeah, I think the pinning system that they've added in this game significantly speeds up the process of doing this for people with terrible memories like me. Now if only I could click it here and then it would like navigate to it, that'd be nice. Adding emergency shelter blueprints to your data bank. Thanks dude. Cool. With the builder tool, you can construct sea bases from raw materials advising against exploring a frozen water continent without a base. No bed, no storage, no place to put a fabricator module, no fun. <laughs> Cute. Is that why it's her lucky one? Okay. And lead. Quartz will need glass. Uh, pretty much we'll just take everything. Or, well, almost everything. Let's ditch the rubber for now. Yeah. All right, cool. Let us go. And build our base. Or at least get started on it. Um, where did I put that? There it is. Oh wait, I made a sea glide, right? And I guess we'll swap it out for the flare. Go speed racer! We don't really need to use this battery yet though. Want to conserve the battery for now. 
And now, once we make our base, we'll go and check out the other various Altera y things. Also, uh, keep an. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I was about to say, keep an eye out for my tube of oxygen that I made. Here it is. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Uh. The. The tube. There. Beautiful. So in case you're wondering why I called this Super Mario World, um, it's a reference to the last playthrough where the last time I put a, a tube set up and whatnot, I named it... I named it Super Mario World 2 because for some reason that day I had that music stuck in my head. Like, a lot. Okay. Blueprints. We don't need to have this pinned anymore. Still want that pin, but for now it's fine. Um, mainly we want this stuff. So hatch and um, I guess we'll start with, oh, I need more copper, fuck. Um, with an X, I guess. Okay, so let me just get my bearings here. So this is where I put my base last time, this area here. Because, and it served a really good one, like there's thermal vents right there for power. Once we get thermal stuff, it's kind of central to a lot of things. The only problem, of course, is that there are sharks, as you can see. Hungry, hungry sharks. That said, it's not terrible. Like, they're, they're fine. Um, but yeah, so we'll put it right here-ish. So let's, let's make this nice container bit here. And then we need a hatch, of course. Warning, 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, I know. I could just use my other, um, my other one to stay down there, but for now, I'm I'm gonna surface. Just because I feel like there's a good chance that I'll just kind of forget. Oh, hi, hi, Altera base thing. Wow, we built right next to it. That's fine. Oh, look at that, they're giving me resources. <laughs> How kind. Okay. So... We'll make a couple other little compartments. But, um, yeah. We really need copper, huh? I'm just gonna make a. We'll make a pretty small base, I guess. Actually, maybe I should. Warning: thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. I'm trying to think. I, I was thinking I'd make like a little uh, square for now. Because I don't think we don't we don't have the blueprints for the giant ones yet, right? Yeah, no, the large rooms. So, um, let's see if I can't find some copper. Because if we get some power to this thing, then we won't have to go up and down as much. God damn it. <laughs> Warning. Parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Parsing. 
Okay, that's two copper. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Indeed. Yank. Uh, there it is. What time of day is it right now, I wonder? Power only. Not enough. <laughs> it's it's night time. Oxygen. And this is why we brought the extra tank. Whew. Nothing like being out in the middle of the ocean. Nothing around you. Cool. So once uh once the day shows up, then that'll be that will be great. So now we don't need that anymore. I mean, we'll make more, obviously, but for now we don't need that. Um, we need silver because I want to make the high um, high capacity auction. But for now, I'll just I'll just keep building our little square out. Or maybe we'll use uh, some of the auction some of um the titanium for a couple other minor things for example for a wall locker oh hey look at that oxygen very nice power restored all primary systems online that's good there now the fabricator module i always like having these like kind of right by the door because I kind of feel like they're best there. So we'll make what we can of it. And then throw some of the stuff we don't need in here. Or not that we don't need it, but that we, we don't need it yet, I should say. Um, how much lead does it take to make a foundation? Just one, right? Oh, it does take two. All right, hold on. We'll build a foundation as well. Doesn't hurt. Oh, nice lag. Good to see that everything still lags when you add a foundation still. Um, rotate right bracket. Oh god. Okay. I kind of don't like the use of brackets for that, but that's that might just be me. You know? I'm just too lazy, I guess. You. Oh. oh, look at that, I don't have enough. There. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Oh, it's fine, don't even worry about it. Cool. Okay, just making sure I had two tanks. Alright, let's try to collect some more copper. And promptly fail miserably. Copper. Yay! See, can you see why I built my base here originally? Like, it's a... It's a good location for it. Because there's lots of resources. They're central to most things. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, it's fine. We have another whole extra tank. As well as our base is right next to us. So. Warning. Oxygen. Oh, I don't even, don't, don't even need the other one. Oh, we have drowning noises now too. That's nice. Big bonus. Um, cool. Unfortunately, the fabricator needs what? More quartz or? Yeah, I need one quartz. Let's go out. Go out looking for it, I guess.
I don't really mind getting extra titanium though. We're just gonna build a whole bunch of wall lockers and then begin the process of having an organized little home full of wall lockers of resources. It's great. It's the way I like to play Subnautica. Horribly, horribly organized. <laughs> so it's really not bad, but um, it definitely makes building easier. I just really wish that uh, silver was easier to find, but I guess we'll just go, we'll go deeper. Oxygen. Noted. Okay. Uh, cool. We'll need, we'll need that, so don't worry. Oh, hi. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I mean, that's cool. Oh, we're right underneath it. Uh, okay. This is going to be our first stop once I'm done with the base, don't worry. There it is. I might as well... Eh, actually, no, we'll, we'll wait. We'll explore that after, don't worry. And this is where we just came up through. Right, our inventory is full. Forgot about that. Oh wait, there's the quartz. Uh, goodbye. We need the quartz more. Cause that fabricator will help us out a lot. Thank you. Dun da da da. -da. Thank you. And there we go. What is it? Wait, why is there an extra axe compartment there? Hold up. What? No. Okay. Look at this. Look at this beautiful little base we have. Cool. Okie dokie. So. What do we need to do here? Make a bit of copper wire. Um, I think we will want to make, where is it? So we need a wiring kit to make this. So battery charging we'll put next to the door as well. Copper wire, wiring kit, titanium. So the wiring kit, that's silver, right? Unfortunately for us, yeah, that's too silver. Okay, I'm gonna put our first set of lockers right by the fabricator. Just cause that, oh, that one's kind of high, isn't it? Don't worry, I, I won't, uh, I won't spurg out too hard on this, but just wanna, <laughs> want it to not be horribly glaringly wrong, you know? Okay, cool. So that's good. Let us begin by dumping copper in here. Copper. We will dump titanium into this one. Titanium. And this will be our in progress stuff, I guess. So, really, I should have put other things in there, but it's just the miscellaneous drawer for now. Because you always need one of those for the things that you haven't quite organized yet. And also... K. 
Okay, now we're good. So we need All terror silver. Signature detected. Okay. Unique identifier. Delta station dock. Uh -huh. Delta station. This is the place Lil mentioned in her message. Lillian is now Lil. Why are we giving her a pet name? I I didn't get the impression that we were close. Warning. Parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Yes, well, you know. Oh, I'm near silver. Where? According to this, I'm near silver. Here? No? Where? Oh. Cool. Alright. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. This first piece of silver is going to um, make our high... What is it called? High capacity? High capacity uh, oxygen tank. Oh, fuck you. Because we have all the other stuff for it. So, we need two pieces of glass. We need one piece of titanium. And we are ready to go. High capacity. Perfect. So I'll hold off on um, on making a second one, I guess, for now. Copper. We will make one, but it, it will wait because I want to have more uh, more silver first and kind of use that for other things like the compass and the uh, the battery charger. So you know, little things, and then after that the next goal will probably be uh, a few other things probably the mobile vehicle bay and what have you but um, we'll do some story stuff first as well and also we'll put some freaking windows in here because bases are bases are only good when they have windows I think um, our our little buddy here is is now dead so I'm gonna dump him and we'll just do you know manual exploration for now use our eyeballs instead thanks for the lead is that galantine i know so like i mean it, it doesn't really hurt uh salt i don't think i care about salt actually Where, oh, shark about, oh no, that's a ray. Um, where, where were we a second ago that we were actually finding silver? It wasn't that far from the base, it was just deeper. We now have six pieces of titanium, very good. I think we were over that way, perhaps. I could also get my, we could bring over the pipes, like the tubes and stuff. Wouldn't be a bad idea. I just want to get my batteries to, I just want my batteries to be able to recharge. And after that, we will go forth. Some more lead. Why is it so much easier to find lead? Like, does that does that seem odd to anyone else? That it's so much easier to find lead than it is other things? Here, yeah, just just connect that, please. Cool. Um Oh, yeah, I guess I'll go down there. So, suit up, and then down we go. Warning: parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Indeed, it did. 
unfortunately for us. We need a reinforced dive suit to prevent that, I think. Quartz. Do you want? Lead. Let's copper, copper. More copper. There's some quartz over here. Yeah, the annoying thing is I feel like I'm gonna end up near the squid sharks before I get all the lead I need. Or not lead, jeez. The silver I need. Titanium, cool, thanks. More quartz. There's another piece. Oh. Oh, he's calling to us, it seems. It's got that weird effect Warning. to it. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Indeed. Don't worry. Yay, silver! Oxygen. Man. I remember... Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. I still remember the stream where someone told me that it's like, oh yeah, you can just use multiple, like, just use multiple tanks of oxygen. And I was like, wait, what? You can do that? Like, the notion of swapping out your oxygen tank just did not occur to me. So, that was pretty great. Uh, the salt can go into miscellaneous. We do need that for uh, some things eventually, but... Okay, so that gives me quartz. Which... Can it, can it get started at least? No, it... <laughs> it needs... It needs the wiring kit to get started. Um, how much silver did I actually get? Did I get more than one? No, I only got one. That is a bummer. At the very least, I got a couple pieces of glass. So, we can go ahead and make a window. Um, I will put one window on the hatch side so that it shines out towards us when we are coming back so it's easier to find and see. Actually, wait, is it? Hold on. If I remember right, I believe these cost two as well, right? No, they only cost one. Oh, they, they cost two. I just need another one. Sorry, window. I loved you. But I'd rather have a have one of these. Probably should have put it over there, but it's fine. I love it. <laughs> as much as I don't personally like the ocean. Um, oh god. Um, I do like kind of being under it. That's a little sense as that makes, I know, but like when I'm in a pool, um, I always enjoy. I always enjoy like diving down into it with a um, like set of goggles and what have you. Why is the lead there? I don't have a wall locker for lead yet. Maybe, you know what? Lead is way more common right now, even though we don't really need it. So I'm going to make a lead locker instead. And then I'm going to make each of these four be a glass compartment, I think. So we'll need more quartz. Oh, it is a shark. It's not a ray. Yeah, all right. Noted. Warning. Parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Oh, God. What? Okay. Lag, please. Our lab and titanium. I don't remember if using the lights causes it to take up more energy or not. I vaguely remember that it 
didn't at any point, but I keep expecting them to change that. Is that silver? No, that's lead. God damn. Some more copper. Not that there's anything wrong with getting a bunch of copper, but... I just would really like some lead, please. So God damn. Silver. Silver. Well, here's gold, at least. Something new. Or, well, not new, but different. Or they could just give us titanium from both. No, nope, not from both. That's that's a plus. Good gold. Lead. Warning: thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, I know. All right. I just want to run in a circle. Oxygen. Yeah, I know. We are somewhat deep down here, aren't we? I'm gonna wait for her to start drowning and then. Ah. Warning: thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay, I gotta check the underside of this place, I guess. Luckily for us, thirty seconds of oxygen is enough to traverse one hundred and thirty meters. So the uh, emergency backup. Is always good. Because I did get a little turned around there. Unfortunately. That's lead? Yeah. Oh, fuck you. See, the faint glimmer of hope chance of silver and then sadness yeah, there's quartz down here warning parsing 100 meters oxygen efficiency decrease Is this silver no still copper uh that's all copper isn't it Hold on, there's an angry lad here. Oh, he's not angry at me though. He's angry at other things. So I care significantly less. Uh, I mean, okay. Is this silver? No, why would it be so? Are there sea truck fragments? Um, copper, 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 copper. I feel like this is somewhat close to where. Um, oh, I've forgotten his name, our alien friend. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, I know. Copper. Yeah, there it is. Warning. Thirty seconds. Oh, hi. How's it going, buddy? If you'll excuse me, I'm uh, I'm a little, a little busy trying to name my beacon. Ah, come on. Oxygen. Douchebag. Drop it. Swap it, and then polka dot it. All right. Well, there's the beacon for uh, the next story Warning. beat. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Which I wasn't trying to find. I mean, I knew it was in the area. But 
wasn't actually trying to find it. <laughs> Figured it'd be more fun to explore to find it later, but. Um, where's our beacon manager? Where's the one I just dropped? Oh shit. I didn't drop Super Mario World, right? Oh yeah, I did. Alright, well you are now blue. Because, actually no, blue is bad. You are now green. Green means alien. Wait a minute, hold up. I'm using the wrong tank. One. And I didn't refill my other one. Thank you very much. Man, if only he'd give us some silver. Copper, copper. I can't help but think about Tommy Wiseau. <laughs> and the way he says Joker when uh, he did his Joker audition tape that he put on YouTube. Uh, if you haven't seen that, there's some high quality. Warning, parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Uh, there we go. Yeah, may I, may I help you? Be gone. Or at least get scanned. Hey, come back. No, no I, I didn't mean it. I didn't mean it. I want to scan you. Oh, fine. I'll get him next time. Oh, our inventory's full. Hey, get, get out of my way. Copper's good. Oh, here we go. Nope, can't do it in peace. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you hide against that wall. I won't get you there. The real apex predator here. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, I know. Hmm. That's oxygen. gold. Yeah, I know. Slowly drowning, but not really. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Alright, well at least I got some quartz. So, I can at least make a couple more windows. Maybe I should, maybe I should swap my scanner's battery into the, um, the detector. Uh, there it is. Um, just to make it easier. Because really, I only want like a teensy bit of silver. I don't want that much. Just a, just a tiny bit. Okay, there's the tube. Hello, tube. Bestest friend. And that's that. Let me just supply cash. Delta station. Okay, so if we had this direction, that's where our base is. There it is. See, so I think you can see. Okay. Yeah, I think previously my base was a little bit closer in that direction, but it's fine. <laughs> Did I get any silver at all? No, we found like two or three silver croppings and none of them gave us anything. What a nightmare. At least I have all this titanium. Did I get enough? I did. Is that two pieces of glass? Yes. Um, here, I'll tell you what. We will... Q. 
cute. We'll make one clap. Excuse you? You you can put one there, it's fine. Really? The titanium is in the way? But you let me deconstruct it. So why? Okay. It's fine. Uh, we'll just move things over. It's no big deal. Just temporarily. Oh, actually I didn't really need to do that. Storage is a go. Actually, I need one of those. I'm gonna put another, uh, what's gonna call it, solar panel on top, just so that we have a small additional amount more. I don't think I've. I don't have a quartz one yet, right? Not yet. I'll think about it. It's so nice. up dude all right well let's dump that right there we'll eventually get thermal heat off of the vents over there over there but for now solar panels I mean not that I'll ever actually deconstruct them but the titanium throw another one there more lead and then we don't have anything for gold yet and the copper wire can go in here so beautiful <sighs> um yeah still want silver and really want to cut god damn it i accidentally Like, unless someone remembers specifically where there's a lot of silver to be had, it is quickly becoming Warning. Parsing 100 meters. Tempting. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Decreased. Your oxygen deficiency has increased, and your efficiency has decreased. Wait. Copper. I know we'll, we'll probably need like a teensy bit more coral at some point, so I'll go ahead and grab it. But I'm gonna try to only grab what we need, and what we need is not copper right now. It's silver. Um, lead, lead. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, I know, but there's a plant right there. Copper, copper. Oxygen. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen Are remaining. You... No. Is this is this where it all is? <gasps> A piece of silver. Oxygen. Yes. Okay. Shh. Stop drowning. Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay. So I will dive straight back down here because it looks like there might be silver in that cave. We need four total, unfortunately. 
because we need enough for a wiring kit for the compass and enough for a wiring kit for the battery charging device. And then obviously we'll, we'll need more. But for now... Parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Where is that cave? Yeah? Also gonna grab quartz as I see it because, you know, I like glass. I like living in a place where one doesn't throw stones, as it were. I'm just gonna swap my blueprints real quick to give us a wiring kit so that we can keep track of how much silver we have. Oh yeah, this cave is good. I think we found the right place. Uh, I should have made another beacon. If I had, we could have marked it. We're nearly 200 meters down. Oh god, lag. We just need one more. One more piece of silver. Please, please, please. Fuck you. Thirty seconds yes. of oxygen remaining. Okay, cool. Oh, hey look. This is right near um What's his face? What is his name? I've I've forgotten oxygen. our alien friend's name. Wait a minute. Thank you. Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. I forgot what we call him, but he's a nice dude. He's British. <laughs> Nothing that has any, any sort of, uh, you know, indication that someone is or is not Oxygen. nice. They're, you know, assholes exist in Britain. I know it's surprising, but they do, even if their accent is quite enjoyable. So head back towards the tube. If we basically stick ourselves between two and the Delta station, then we are at the base. It's right over here. Right, right over here. It doesn't glow as much. Maybe it's, its lights are on, right? I feel like the, um, the lights were brighter before. Just gonna continue our adventures of having power. I want it to be able to last the night. Even though that did just use quartz I could have used to make glass, but... Okay, so... Give me wiring kits. And give me... What else? What am I looking for? Nothing? Nothing. Cool. Sorry, copper wire is what I meant when I said wiring kits. I mean, I want wiring kits too, but... We have to make those first. And I even have one extra piece of silver. Which we could use to make um, our other Finally, air tank a device bit. that can put to good use those rechargeables lost to the back of the catch all draw. Um oh God, I don't know how to do this in computer mode. Whoops. Also health, um, compass, but wait, hold on. How do you, 
how do I swap the um, the battery out? R. So that will work that, and then we want to make our compass so we can finally get our bearings straight. And then probably a beacon, honestly. Um, oh, we are now full up on titanium, which is fine. So battery charger is good now. Wiring kit's good, compass is good. This is really the only one that we're, we need to work on. <clears throat> so. Mainly need quartz, I guess. It's the main thing I need. Just throw the hatch on there. Um, yeah, but we can do, um, let me get a little bit of quartz and then make a second good oxygen tank. And then we can go ahead and go get the other story beat. Gold and silver. Actually, my gold's in there. So this is this is the tricky part: deciding when I have enough resources to actually create the, the locker for it. Probably enough now, right? We'll just use one interior crocodile alligator. Drive the Chevrolet movie theater. There we go. Gold. Okay. And um, you, you can be silver. And um, oh gee, I don't know. I guess I'll put another wall locker right. We can probably put two in here. Oh yeah. Nice little storage closet, basically. So that's good. Um, that's silver quartz. Actually, why don't we make We'll make another battery. Because we're going to need one, we're going to need it for later in order to make a power cell for the C truck. Um, but also just to have, uh, you know, the option, basically. So we can continue to recharge that stuff, which is good. And then we now have two silvers, which is awesome. Copper can go away, and then I don't have a quartz one yet, right? Not yet. So congratulations, you have been elected to be quartz. Beautiful. Okay, so story next. Let's see, according to our voice logs, let's see, we have the Altair Beacon, the Delta Station Dock, which we could go to. Um, that's about it. Oh, and Alien. I think we'll do Alien first. That'll be more fun. 
and uh, I think that will be the maybe the end of tonight's stream. What time is it currently? Where's my phone? Where is my phone gone to? There it is. Wow, it's only 6.20. Hey. Sorry. Okay. Um, that's earlier than I thought. But I haven't had dinner yet, so... That could be something that I do. Actually, you know what? We'll leave behind one. We won't take the scanner with us. Wait, what? Wait, I have a totally dead battery? Oh, okay. Very good. So I just, I'll put the scanner away. And now, off we go. Let's see, we, will, we don't want a Galena. We want the Ar Argentina, <laughs> whatever it is. Uh, I wasn't that far off. Okay, so it's over by Super Mario World. That was, that was where our nice cave was. Hi. Parsing 100 meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. Hello, Quartz. More lead. Uh, I'll grow. I'll harvest some coral. We'll put it into a locker. Call it good. Let's um let's get the logs over here too. I believe over to our northwest here. There should be some Altera stuff. Silver fuck you. Take the gold though. Ever feel like gold has a better drop rate than silver and no, that's very strange. Oh boy. Where? 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 Thanks for dying. Appreciate you. I do actually. We, we need that sulfur stuff for uh, the repair tool, I believe. So that's good. Yes. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Noted. All right, I lied. Oxygen. I lied. Not going to alien land yet. Since I picked up that crystalline sulfur, I just want to make sure we have enough, enough happiness and joy. Um, we have enough quartz to make another piece of silver, which is good. Oh, you motherfucker. I dropped it. God, that happened last time too. All right, hold on. We need to find my tank. It would have fallen right here, right? There it is. God. <laughs> the worst thing to happen.
Okay, back down we go. Super Mario World. I guess some more quartz. Thank you. You look at lead. Warning. Parsing there it 100 is. meters. Oxygen efficiency decreased. And there's another piece of quartz. Cool. So let's get the log from here and then go over to Alien Land. New technology acquired. Oh fuck yeah. What do what do you need, Mr. Rebreather? A wiring kit using that silver we just got, fiber mesh and rubber. Okay, so we need to go visit some creep finds. I think I'm going the right way. I think. If not, we'll just follow them the opposite direction. Ah, oh, no, we did. This is the right way. Warning. No. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. No commentary on this, Sam? Hello? Is someone there? Intermember speaking. We're running out of time. What is all this? Seeking emergency storage unit. Oh fuck, I don't have my scanner. It's better if you show yourself. If we could show ourselves, we would not need storage. You mean you don't have a physical presence? Are you one of them? An architect? Storage medium identified. We will be lost unless we find a new host. Can you help? Can you use my PDA for storage? You are not with the group from before. Your cybernetic components bear their signal. Altera? <laughs> no, my equipment is, uh, borrowed. It will have to do. <laughs> Good miscommunication there. Um, yeah, I, I'm unhappy that I don't have my scanner because there's probably things to scan here. But then again, they haven't been that great about the lore um, logs. So I'm just going to... Oh, piss. I'm just going to not worry about it, I guess. Get, get up. There we go. Hey there, little fella. How you doing? Oh, sweet. Cubes. Yes, please. I'll throw one down in my base and scan it later. Hi. How are you? <laughs> He's on me. <laughs> Dun, da, da, da. How long have you been stored here? Longer than that. Warning. Sanctuary power critical. Our data can be downloaded from the terminal. We may speak more once the transfer is complete. They yes. changed the okay. voice again. Hurrying. It reminds me of um uh what's the name of Professor Snape's voice actor? And also he's the robot in uh, Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy and the way that this guy sounds very much reminds me of that robot at the moment. Insert storage medium, also known as ourselves. Storage medium accepted. Brace for transfer. Brace? Ah! Ah! What's happening? How do you feel? 
Why do you sound like you're inside my head? The facility identified hospitable capacity within your cerebral cortex. You are in my head? I offered you my PDA! Get out! Oh, no. Does your kind perceive a boundary between cybernetic and organic components? My mind is not a component! You sound angry. We will allow you a moment to process. <laughs> Don't you go silent on me! Hello? This is not happening. That's the explanation. It's not happening! Whoa, God! Just saw down my neck like I was Duke Nukem ready to take a shit. Sanctuary power really was critical though, wasn't it? Alan Rickman, that's his name. Took me a while to remember. Wait, isn't that his name? Alan? Or something like that? Our alien friend. Oh god, that can't be a convenience. It's convenience. Coincidence. Wow. Brain. What are you doing? Come on, talk to us more, please. Warning. Passing 200 meters. Oxygen efficiency greatly decreased. Take that. There's the altar a bit. There's more quartz. And also uh, the path down to the squid, I think, is down through there. More quartz. I'll grab oxygen from the flower in a second. And more quartz as well. Eight pieces of quartz, awesome. In case you're wondering why I put hatch onto the uh, pin list, it's because I like to keep an eye on how much quartz and um, cough. Sorry, how much quartz and titanium I'm picking up. Oh, you bitch. So that, that's, that's why. All right, I'll grab auction and then we will head back to base where we will have a conversation with our alien friend. And then I will add a couple more small components, probably. Small components to my base, and we'll be good. Um, probably make a rebreather, too, if I can. If we run into any creep vine along the way back, which we should. Oh, hi. Ow. Yeah, you are right there, huh? Although I can't actually carry creep vine, can I? I don't have enough uh, space for it. Should be close to our base now. There's the tube. So head towards Delta from the tube. Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. There it is. Oxygen. Oh, press T to answer. Uh, I I will give me a hot second there, buddy. We understand this arrangement is. Oh, really? Track is undesirable to you. You're not real. Go away. <laughs> to go, we require a suitable body for transfer. Why do you keep saying we? 
How many of you are there? One of us and all of us. We do not think of ourselves as individual. Distinct. Sorry to be interrupting the dialogue like that, but I just want to have batteries charging while we wait. If it will make you comfortable, I can use the singular. Oh yes, that's what's bothering me. Thank you. Why don't you start by telling me who you are? You may append your seed code to my species designation. Please call me Al Am. Alan? My whole life I've been dying to meet a sapient spacefaring alien up close, and you're telling me your name is Alan? Is it insufficient? No, it's fine. Perfect. Where are you from, Alan? Your kind calls us architects. A precursor race? But what are you doing here? That is a long story. Perhaps you would prefer to focus on the construction of a new storage medium to which I may transfer. Yes. Fine, absolutely. How do we get you out of my head? I have added the information to your data bank. You will need to find the necessary components. Any idea where I can find them? It is unclear. I have been disconnected from my network for so long I cannot locate the coordinates. <sighs> w. What did that change to W? Okay. I probably accidentally did it. But now we have two high storage mediums. Hit. Um, so we're good there. And then... Lastly, da -ka -da -ka, deconstruct that and throw this here. Beautiful. Look at that. So nice. Uh, I might keep this one not, what to call it, glass, um, and maybe build vertically up a little bit to make it easier to spot this place. Also, when we get a scanner room, I might stick it like right there. So there's that. Um, we need the rebreather. So there's a small trip out into the wilds for that. The other things, I think we can make a computer chip actually. Two corals and a wire. Yeah, so that's that's enough for that. Thank you. We now have a computer chip. Which is good for the mobile vehicle bay. Uh, so we'll make the mobile vehicle bay as well. Should be exciting. I don't need an advanced wiring kit yet. Laser cutter we can't do yet. We do have rubber though, don't we? So I'll only need the fiber mesh. Uh, gold we made a place for, right? Yes, we did. Gold, the crystalline sulfur we can throw in there. Ink it in there. Glass into the quartz section. Not with the lead though, please, thank you. And then the lead here. I know it's not the most exciting thing in the world to watch someone manage their inventory space, but it is an important thing, unfortunately. Come on. Beautiful. So, now we'll always have at least one battery and good to go. And let me just get some creep. Uh, lubricant requires their seed, while the mesh requires... Is it just one? Or is it two? I want to say it's two. It is. Two. Um, let's try to find ourselves some seed. Where it's all nicely budding creep vine, but ah, there we go. 
Is it just one or is it more? Just one. So we'll take what we need and leave. Thank you very much. Maybe risk a little bit more copper. Hello, explosion lad. Thank you, once more. Very good. That's not anything useful, right? No. Ah, but quartz is. That nice bright light, and of course our base is there. But yeah, once you have glass and whatnot, it always becomes a lot easier to find your base after. So, kind of want to throw a hatch here too, just to be able to enter from more than one direction. And I need to throw down a um, a thing though. Okay. Good. So get the wiring kit out and. And the computer chip. Thank you, thank you. We're good. Throw the lead in. Don't need that. Um, let's see. So, lubricant, mesh, yada yada. Ah, one of these. There we go. Should have everything. So, a bit of lubricant. Bit of fiber mesh. Ooh, I didn't grab enough. We needed another one. Oh, we need two Greek, two seed clusters to make rubber. All right. Well, in that case, that's fine. We'll make the mobile vehicle bay, and we'll throw it outside. And then after that, we will go fetch ourselves what we need for a rebreather. There you go. Uh, okay, you apparently need to release it. Go, go, gadget, mobile vehicle bay. Bye. Okay, so that's going to go up there. <laughs> mobile vehicle bay, mobile vehicle bay. So unpin that and now pin that. So we'll definitely need more silver as per usual, but at the very least, we can make the rebreather. We just have to find two bits of delicious creep vine seed. There we go. There's one and two. Question, do I have the blueprints to make a garden thingy? Exterior modules, no I don't. Ah, uh, our mobile vehicle bay isn't gonna show that for a bit. Okay, that's fine. The rebreather facilitates extensive free diving by recycling air more efficiently at significant depths. Breathe the freedom. Cool. Oh, the PDS what's talking again. Oh, wait, never mind, no, it's not. Okay, cool. So that's, that's pretty good, I think. We've made some pretty significant process, uh, progress. 
so that's that is a bonus um, yeah I should make a beacon real quick just to dump it on my base so I don't have to keep navigating via the tube but it should be okay we're gonna need diamonds which we can get directly beneath us actually we're really close to diamonds believe it or not so I wish you could just like immediately drop it in. There we go. Cool. So yeah, it's, it's not bad. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll start a coral locker. Coral! Beautiful. Cool. Once we go to the Delta Station, we'll probably get a bunch of additional recipes blueprints for things like I think at least the aquarium um, so that would be good that said I th think we could probably build a sea truck before we bother going out to Delta Station because while well, we can swim there and it will be fine we do have to deal with the, um, the little mini Godzilla lads and they're less of a like way less of a threat if you have a sea truck so not that they're much of a threat anyway, but you know, a little, some little things. But there's also a chelly on the other side of the island, so we we want to be able to escape quickly so we don't get eaten. Uh, let's save one, um, and yeah, it's uh it's good. So I am going to go eat dinner now, but this has been an extremely productive. Extremely productive first stream, I think, of uh, the update sort of, I don't know what to call it. I, I almost want to say re-release, but that's not quite the right thing to say. Because it's, it's, it's not that. <laughs> um, it's, it's an update. You know, the um, whatever they... No, good God. Um, whatever they called it. Oh, hey, you can actually see the individual solar panel charges. That's pretty cool. Also, cool. Uh, let's call this square base. Because we'll have more than one, for sure. Oh, my, my beautiful little base. Let me just take a screenshot of it. Yeah. Cool. So I'm gonna go eat dinner. Um, next time we can go and we'll build a sea truck. How about that? That'll be our first goal. We'll dive down deep, deep, deep down there. Now that with the rebreather and everything else, so we'll be able to do things better. Um, but there's diamonds down by the squids. So we'll be able to get one of those in order to make enameled glass. Uh, we'll have to go down there anyway to collect silver. Unless I can find that really nice cave again. But either way, be good. Okay, save now that for the beacon out and call it good. So, thanks for joining me, checking out the uh, Relics of the Past update with all the new voice acting that they've added in. I I like the voice acting they added in. I like I like Alan Rickman, <laughs> Alan Al Rickman. He's good. So, I will see you all next time. Bye for now, everyone. Have a good rest of your night or rest of your day whatever it is, wherever you are, and take it easy.